Welcome to the first ever episode of Speed News with a focus on PlayStation speedrunning and early PlayStation classics, as well as world records, drama, and anything happening in between with all that fucking shit. Is it niche? Yes. Is it pointless? No, because there's a lot to cover today and there's been a lot happening in the last few days. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's get right into the news. The first thing I want to cover is that GDQ is coming up in two fucking days. What that means is that there's going to be a huge stream with all sorts of speedrunners all throughout the world competing to become the best speedrunner of all and kissing. Killing each other to see who's the last man standing battle royale style. If you're interested in that, be sure to check out the links in the description down below. I'm going to be doing a run for it and it's going to be a great stream. But without further ado, let's talk about some of the recent world records happening in our beautiful PlayStation community today. Most recently, we have a record in Spiral 1, Vortex Percent, by Nova Spell, the legend, the queen, the fucking furry drawing fucking legendary fucking bitch, Nova, I love you. She got a 2050 in Vortex Percent, Spiral 1, unprecedented to even get a sub 21. There was a time, I will tell you, there was a time when even a 22 in that category was thought to be stretching it. And now we're looking at sub 21. Let's go, Nova. That's awesome. Congrats to you. But wait, a challenger approaches. Recently, a fellow runner has also tied Nova's 2050. And now the race is on for the 24X. And dare I say, 23X is on the horizon. You'll have to tune into her stream and find out. But congrats to you, Nova. And the race is on. Next up, we have a Spyro 2 legendary run. Many of you who have tangentially heard of Spyro speedrunning may be familiar with the Spyro 2 any percent run and how broken and short it is. You literally, it's just a boss rush and then that's it. It's basically insane out of bounds strategies in every home world and then praying for gulp RNG to be on your side. Spora 777777 has completely demolished Spyro 2 any percent, getting a time of 7 minutes 36 seconds. Recently, this was just under a week ago, Spora popped the fuck off in his chat with an insane flurry of messages, and you know, you gotta give it to the guy. He's been working so hard in this category. Uh, that Vladimir profile pick, you know, you know he's coming for blood and he demolished the last any percent record by 12 seconds. And for such a short category that is fucking insane, you really gotta give it to him, not just for the insane boss RNG, but for the awesome execution on his part as well. So congrats to you, Spore. Next up, we're moving into another PlayStation classic, Jack and Daxter, outrageous Josh. He's so fucking outrageous, I can't handle it. He's outrageous, he just keeps getting world records and sweeping the whole leaderboards. And most recently, he has gotten the no Fire Canyon skip world record time of 23 minutes and 16 seconds, demolishing his previous world record by six seconds. And let me tell you, this run is a sight to behold. Clean skips all over the game. His lava tube skip was immaculate. He got all three one frames at the very end of the run. And man, just seeing his reaction at the end, going like, oh frick, oh my God. It's just, it's, it warms your heart. It warms my cockles of my heart. And it makes me want to get into Jack and Daxter speedrunning, seeing this guy play. So congrats to you, Josh. You're a legend and I love you. I can't wait to see you again and give you a big old hug. Now, finally, on the world record list today, we can't talk about recent PlayStation world records without mentioning the Rixers legendary Rack One New Game Plus world record. In this game, the Rixer has always been a huge help and inspiration to me and my channel. He really lifted me up with his documentary that he did about me. And he's the homie. I was under the impression that he was done doing runs. He's focusing on his YouTube, he's doing his thing, but God damn, if this man isn't a speedrunner at the core, and he grinded the fuck out of his Ratchet and Clank New Game Plus and demolished 
Franz's multi-year long standing 1851 and beat it by one fucking second to get an 1850 barely squeezing it out. There's a ton of history behind this category and this run and Zem92 covers it very beautifully in his commentated video that I'm going to have linked down below in the description. But rest assured, the Rixer is no stranger to this category and he is a legend for finally bringing it back after all of these years. Uh, not to mention all of the work he's been doing in Jack 3 as well. Thank you so much to everything that you've done, Ricky, for both the community, myself, and for bolstering these games, most importantly, that we all love so much. So thank you, Ricky. You're a fucking legend. And finally, we have, uh, as I mentioned at the beginning, we have our Battle Royale GDQ stream coming up. Okay, it's not actually a Battle Royale. No one's gonna die, but... Uh, it is going to be a very big stream on Twitch, and it's happening in literally two days from now at the time this video has been posted. Actually, one day from now from the time this video has been posted. And it's going to be an amazing, amazing event. I'm doing a run of Spiral 1 Any%. Percent. Please check it out. It's going to be at 1.30 p.m. on July 4th. But some other runs you, might, you guys might want to watch out for... We have 007 Nightfire by Call Me Liam. We have Ratchet and Clank Into the Nexus by Mobius. Crash 4 by Jordy925. And Tomb Raider Anniversary by Persky, just to name a few. And don't forget about Rayman by The Extra. Ton of great PlayStation runs, you know, that you love to see that representation in GDQ. Um, and I gotta say, it's a real honor to be a part of the, of the uh, stream and the run. And I can't wait to give you guys some great commentary. And if you're curious, you've not heard of GDQ, Please check the link down below to follow their Twitch channel. It's going to be a week-long stream where they're going to be showing all sorts of runs from games you would have never even thought had speedruns for them. Shit like Destiny 2. And, like, you can't speedrun Destiny 2, but it's there. <laughs> so there you go. Uh, GDQ is going to be a blast, and I hope to see you guys in the chat there. And that is going to conclude our first episode of Speed News for the week. If you guys like this series, feel free to let me know in the comments that you want to see more and... Uh, give me any of the recent speed happenings that's been happening, especially with a uh, focus on early PlayStation speedrunning. I'm all about this shit. I literally have no life, and I just focus on most of this stuff for most of my day, and I just stream for the rest of it. So any additional information or thoughts that you guys have regarding PlayStation runs or recent cool speedrun drama or shit like that, let me know in the fucking comments. But until then, I'll catch you guys next time, and keep fucking gaming, you goddamn legends. I'll see you next time. Peace. Ah, coffee tastes like shit. Damn.